Mackenzie Critiques. It is Mackenzie Critiques. Let's get something straight here. It's called Mackenzie Critiques. Not Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Not Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Not Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Mackenzie Critiques and Mackenzie Dick Rides Your Favorite Anime. Welcome to a live reaction to the OVA or movie, I forgot which it is, to Kara no Kyokai. I don't know what this is about. I've heard a brief synopsis from some of my close subs about it. Seemed interesting. It's come up a few times in the last year or so. So I thought, you know what, let's get into this. I'm deciding now that I want to start reacting to movies, anime movies, the great ones. You know, the uh, Tokyo Godfather, Millennium Actress, Perfect Blue, Angel Egg, uh, or things similar to that, which are slightly more feature length than. You know, so Kara no Kyokai is about seven or eight films. So I'm gonna start with this one, see how it goes. Uh, these things, obviously, I'm gonna do periodically. So there's no, I don't feel like I'm obligated to do it in a timely fashion. So it's great for me, you know, if I've got less time sometime. So without further ado, let's get to this. This is the Kara no Kyokai film number one. There's a bunch of secondary names for it, but I just cannot be bothered. Let me just get into the fucking watching of it, yo. Kara no Kyokai, film one. Come on. Aniplex, Acacia, Kodansha, Notes. UFO, UFO Table Production. Mirai Fukuin is the subtitle for this film. Kara no Kyokai, Mirai Fukuin. So the end. Mobile phone, old school. The cost of a world, oh God. Shiki Yogi. Be a better person. What's that foreshadowing? What the hell did that opening just mean? Holy shit, that animation, man. Just busting that out that old school phone. Bomber man. What the hell is going on? Bomber man. Oh fuck. What fucking terrorist is this? Oh fuck it up. What's the deal, man? Why is she bringing a knife to a bomb fight? <laughs> Forget fucking bringing a knife to a gunfight. Future size absolute. Let's get the bot call in progress. So she was talking to someone. The God of Sinners recalled out some of future blessing. Interesting, interesting. Future sight, past sight. It doesn't seem like he can save anything, he can stop anything. The UFO table do knows is exactly the same in all the animes. It's a particular angle and point 
which is distinctive from other animes. Always got sharp noses. It's kind of like how Shaft have their own style of drawing these sorts of characters. That fake zero, yo! That fake stay you know it, yo! What is going on? Is that nun that was? Is this a convent or something? She's dressed like a fucking nun. Good music, nice music. I have no clue where this is set, what country, what the hell is going on, what is possible, what isn't possible, what's grounded, is it grounded, is it not grounded? Let's see. To the next bus. Oh, a dog that <laughs> you call her a bitch. You call her a bitch, fam. Good father. Now, now, Naomi. These people, quiet girls, like <laughs> dead sound. What is that anyway? What are they wearing? What is this? Magic school or some shit? <laughs> The dad probably shopped off here, man. In a hurry. <laughs> At least they're fully dressed, man. These female characters. Usually animes like this, with the character designs like this, they're underdressed. <laughs> They've gone to legs to make a really cute scene, man. Nande bonai. Saw a future that everything played out, it should. Are these gifted kids like it should? Sekayori, they were all sort of gifted in some form. There we go. Thanks. Bring her back stuff, yeah. <laughs> She's got hair like the major from Gitz. Slightly long bangs, I guess they're called. A short crop. Short at the back as well. Two of me. One in the present, one in the future. Oh, wow. A responsible god of sorts. She reminds me of the 12 Monkeys, the woman in the 12 Monkeys TV series. She can see all possible versions of herself in timelines. I live a boring life. That's good enough, man. Like, what do you do with that power in it? If everything plays out how it should and you can't change anything, you see the future, you see the past, all that stuff. What do you do? It is a boring life, I guess. It's all boring power as well. She just tried winning the lottery. All alone on the bus. I'm for two this. Uh, <laughs> Long last journey, man. Somebody stops. 
What, what was that school? Like choir girl school? Convent for nuns or some shit? Seems like a grounded world. Mifune Station, so Tokyo, Japan, so on. Kyoto, I don't know. It seems more countryside. Kyoto does. <laughs> that is fucking brushed on, huh? Punch him in the dick, man. Oh. I see to see the future. You got run over. Oh shit. <laughs> oh fuck. She could warn him. But that won't change anything. Car crashes aren't really always that messy, man. More internal bleeding and internal organ damage. Crack ribs, crack bones. She could tell him, but why is she doing it? And no one listens to her, but no one believes her. He doesn't even know she's referring to him. You scam artist looking guy. <laughs> No one's going to believe her. If you have that bag. So if you don't. What's the bag got to do with it? She's got one of those uh, vo over overly squeaky voices, man. Oh well. <laughs> in steps the next character, yeah? I love how in anime they just step in like that. Very random characters. <laughs> she definitely needs attention, man. What can she do? He still wants to go where he wants to go. He'll get run over either here or there. Well, funny, you know, he was happened to be there when he overheard her talking like that. And he's pertain he pertains to the grand grander plot. Oh, she's always right. What's his interest now? She's not even questioning who the hell he is. We want to avoid. There, yeah, that's the truck. If I've dodged him here, he's going to hit him at some point. For someone who sees so much of the future and the shit that happens to people, she's really of a nervous disposition. What was that explosion? Ooh. 
recommend me some films people that you know I like like you legit know I like based on what I've liked before I love Monster L-O-T-G-H Psychopaths you're completely right Wow, <laughs> brush death, man. Her fucking blushing is coming out of her cheeks, <laughs> like their hairs. <laughs> UFO table eccentricities, man. Catch your breath with me over in that cafe over there. <laughs> Who is this guy? Why is he so interested? Is this like his way of picking up women on the street? Oh, I have uh, over here. Did you say this? <laughs> Hour before the next train. Who are you? Why do you care, man? Is it normal for girls to just get chatted up like this? <laughs> Take an interest. Kokuto Bikia. What? It's like meeting someone, a friend for the first time. I guess she felt like she's meeting a friend for the first time. And she can see the future as well. Bought me she or something. Bikia sat together. Alright, let's see how where they go. Throb. <laughs> Whoa, what the hell's up? Throb. <laughs> Did she just see his dick or something? July 27, 1970 could have been Superman. How come I desired? Wow. So he seems to be the bomber man. Fuck! Why is he doing all this? Or is he just the wrong type of guy with the with the right power? Peace, my boring peace, like Maxima. Bloody hell! He did the exact type of threat. Nothing ever caught me by surprise. What drives him? What does he want? Come acts of terrorism. The bomber man for hire. So other people got things out of blowing shit up. Shit, the most money you can make. Alright, alright. Because you can navigate easily with the future site. If you're going to get caught or not, it was planned, you know. Oh, wow. Nice food. Summer. There he is again, that dude. They have to say his name a few more times before I remember it. (laughs) 
Who is this chick? Doesn't look like that friendship before it lasted long. Is that a bomb? Oh fuck! Would you, uh, hold on. If he was still friends with that girl, that girl would have told him that that was gonna blow up that building, that dude. But it doesn't seem as though they hooked up. This girl and that glasses dude hooked up. And she thinks that guy, guy is responsible that she saw. It's not too far from the truth, man. Bomber man, summer. Or did she just leave because she knew he'd be okay? The glasses do. It's dangerous over there. Yeah. Is that the girl? The, the cutesy little girl has now become a hardened bitch. Or is that some other woman, this chick? <sighs> Holy shit. So she did know. But it seems as though she didn't warn that glasses dude. Because she probably thought he'd be okay. No need for her. Fuck. How do you two people fight who've got premonition? We can see the future. How do those two people do battle? It's like a chess game where you know the move and the other person knows your move as well. Time bomb in an abandoned building. That's how she. Oh, that's the girl in the. Who was in that coin, that explosion? Yeah. That probably happens in the future, that beginning event. Something's weird. On a whim, fuck. So she didn't actually know. Fuck yeah. Boss, I've got your smokes. August 3rd We've gone back, I guess In time He's trying to He's like a recruiter, I guess A recruiter of uh, Future side people He's always on the lookout, I guess I see, I see Same as yesterday. <laughs> Weekly specials, isn't it? I don't like root blueberry, man. I don't know why. I prefer tangier's fruits. Or he. Iced cocoa. <laughs> That's such a little girly thing to water, man. She's not old enough to have coffee or, or wine or beer. Nah, that's the most 
not the most convincing awesome man what's the real reason PT to me You know, the weird thing with some animes is these conversations don't sound natural, man. They're, they're deliberating over what they said and what they were doing, like... This would be your entirely serious, but yeah. Because they need the conversations to uh, communicate exposition, but you know, character development as well. But I'd rather do it through mannerisms and ticks than, you know, weird sort of stilted dialogue. <sighs> oh here we go, the two hands on the fucking thighs. <laughs> I can see the future. He knows, he's not even surprised. All the second. We're flipping back and forth. They need her on their team. <clears throat> so like Bunga Stray Dogs, yeah, a group of uh, gifted people. And they're going on a recruiting. Sends them to the police. Well, if he knows everything's gonna go to plan, no matter what, then it's also like mockery, premonition. <laughs> exactly. Mother of Mifune. <laughs> wow did really extreme measures to avoid stuff yeah bloody hell this bitch's breasts are popping out man she used to get a bigger size shirt Bomber man, it's a man and it? it's not a fucking female man. He's she saw him, or suspects she saw him. This is a day later, after that conversation that the guys, <coughs> that the guys having with the girl that he just met. You felt to able to do some fucking great animation. This isn't as great as Fate Zero, but this is definitely on par with some of their best. <coughs> do do our music sit. Wow, look at that, she's in the fucking Oh my god, I want you about this voice actress. What is she getting ready for a funeral? No, you're not the bomber. Man. She reminds me of the 
the woman, the witch of the waste in uh, House Movie Castle. To a murderer like you. She probably kills people she thinks is the bomb of that. Wow, she does. She probably won't be catching him. Because we've already seen a flash to the future, if I'm not mistaken. So she didn't catch him then. That's why we, we've been given a glimpse of that future. Does he see the future? That's that's what I want to I'm sure he does. Middle school. Gone through a lot. You're a tough cookie, aren't you? Speak to her like she's a kid, man. She is a kid. No. <laughs> I wanna cry. He understands me. He understands me. I did have a hard time in school. <laughs> Here we go. Another excuse to go to a flashback. My Shiba Inu. A dog, yeah? Shiba Inus are cute dogs, man. Seriously. Tosa Inu. What? Did it strangle itself? I cried at night. I forgot that character's name. A character design looks so much like a character Fate Zero. <laughs> Sound light. Shit. What the hell happened? <clears throat> She saw it happen once in her future, then she came, she came to the realization of it as well. That's like two, two times sadness, knowing that someone's gonna die and actually experiencing the death. Miki Asan, what? Is that saying, I wanna call you Dexter today? I wanna call you a pleb today? <laughs> <laughs> I want to call you Mickey Asad. <laughs> Ironic because her friend called her a dog. You're more of a, you're not a cat. You're more of a dog. <laughs> and now she's giving people dogs names. The people with these powers, the one you love, there he is. Like, they, they can be used for bad. It's a passive ability, seeing, only seeing. But they can be used for ill will, like the bomber man. He doesn't actually, you know. He does it for other people who pay him. He doesn't have any own reason to do bombs. 
have we met before? <laughs> Pick me up, so she's a lesbian. Yeah? It's very possible she likes the redhead that she works for, the, her boss. Oh shit, is that advice? That they really mean enough to kill you though. It could be that she doesn't die, man. I still have yet to see the outcome of that explosion. Three days. Premonitions. <laughs> you can't control. Oh shit. Best grades. That's why I'd use it for. <laughs> I'm not even smart. But you have the smartness to memorize them. If you can memorize them by seeing them in the future, why can't you memorize them? In, in the present. Yeah, that's the worst. And sometimes that's the case. You can't change shit, man. Yeah. B for an A lots of times. John won't die. <laughs> Same direction he did. <clears throat> he but we bumped brush past her. Was he asking her these questions? Yeah, he did. He ate brush pasta. But what does that matter? Is it my touch? Hollow shrine. Is it my contact that she's able to read people? Maybe. She looked a bit scared, nervous when she saw it. She has no nose here, man. <laughs> practically. As your elder. <laughs> Can he see the future? Wow. Several types of future sight. It does. They work there. Prediction and evaluation. They just see what happens there. Yeah. <laughs> well it is it's an event that happens sixth sense Shiki oh she has sixth sense so she doesn't know but she feels it 
shaky, okay. Okay. She wasn't like that. Yeah. <clears throat> she has a sixth sense based on stuff that happens in the here and now. Predictive ones can only see what happens, like an event, but they don't know what leads up to it. They don't feel it. Oh shit, Pokemon. What's this? Only you can choose your present. The evaluation type are more empathetic, I guess, to people's feelings. They feel more. It's a sixth sense. Infers it. She seems very yeah, empathetic, exactly. She didn't infer it from her surroundings. She saw him before she saw it. And it's like what she was saying. You look like a con man with that bag. Like she, she was observing things about him. <laughs> wow, she's nervous, she likes to eat. This guy doesn't seem to have any sort of premonition power. She, she is the other one, it's a sense. You are that special. <laughs> Why not? Oh wow, uh, exactly. See the future from that is a gift. I can see a little to the future too. Is that a joke? It's only immediately to the future. Bullshit, not everyone can. Because what came to pass was he survived it. Yeah, yeah. Fate versus free will kind of uh, debate here. Live your life without regrets. <laughs> that sparkly eye.
you see three days in the future. Yeah. Yeah, she's really strict because he's an elder. No, always listen to your elders, fam. If we get a memento, she's going to ring him up. Come work for a minute. I mean, this, this, this isn't just a pointless interaction. There is a fucking reason behind this interaction. It's to recruit her, man. He knows that she's going to take that card. And how to fix them. Yeah, and I forget worrying about the future. Just focus on changing your life. It's like worrying about things that may come to pass. You're off by a little bit. The orange pie. The house challenge. Missing the fans and fans. Exactly. Things don't always turn out exactly as you imagine. Some things are unexpected, but it doesn't matter, you know, some flower or not. Please. Yeah, man. <laughs> she saw that time, man. It's the other people paying him to do it. He doesn't mind telling her where he is because he knows it's still going to turn out all good for him. Man. Bullshit. <laughs> She's awfully confident for someone with just six cents. <laughs> You're gonna die. She does die though, in the intro. Inevitable. He's so confident because he does. Wow, he can see definites. Yeah. You get, even if you change the variables, it's probably going to be changing existing variables. The no new variables will be added. Personal within six years. He goes with the flow, man. But the fact that he knows means that he he feels that he keeps going on for the ride. It looks like got Kitsugi's hammer. Condition. He visualizes. Is that what she was saying? Infer it from the surroundings. He visualizes where he has to be. There we go. So hold. That bit at the beginning, she's survived multiple times. She has more than just six cents, man. There, see? So that wasn't in the future, man. That was actually something that's happened before. Bloody hell. She has six cents. She knows when the bomb's exploding. The thing is, when you infer from the surroundings, you have to be precise. You have to picture her right next to it. Okay, I've got to press it now. And she'll do it like <laughs> kind of fucking check his things. They'll only come to pass. Because, you know, you, you can't deal with people with six cents. They'll see something coming before it happens. Bloody hell. Is she superhuman or something? Survive an explosion. 
I guess it really is just a sixth sense. But you have to be so precise. No matter how much of the future you know is set in stone, you have to be precise. The, the fucking formula has to add up. If you're slightly off, it won't come. She's the unknown variable. The, the sixth sense variable. Oh! I am so dumb. This is the parking lot. I'm pretty sure she dies. We, we don't know the outcome though. I certainly thought she died in that explosion. But over here it seems. She busts out her knife and then. She's got to be dead here right? There's no way she can survive that explosion. With all the cars going off. He had contingencies for this as well. Everything happened. Hey. Ah, uh, now it makes sense. Does she die though? There, the other eye is open. Yep, he sees it. This time she won't fucking survive it. Whoa. Innocent people. He's, he almost sees it like a phantom of what's about to happen. He visualizes it based on her surroundings. Will she... Oh. What the hell is this power? She had her sixth sense kicked in. What? What is she cutting? What is that? Is that a visual representation of his power? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Why did he just press the button? Oh. Why is it going off? But they went off at the beginning. Maybe that was what he saw. Had it been simple prediction, he might have actually killed me. You see too much. Wow, so I guess that intro was him seeing the future change. That was his vision of her dying. But now I think this is, it did change. There's no such thing as the future, you can't just... Possibility, but there's multiverse, right? Multi multiverse. You follow the particular multiverse, I guess I understand. Knowing what happens is the same as, you know, the path by which you came. Yeah. Bridges and a screw. Yeah, he refused to evaluate. I, that's that's actually quite smart. He was so fixated on that future coming to pass, he didn't evaluate the possibilities that would have led to it. Fuck. Why was it working there? It jammed. And now it, now it seemed to have worked. Every motherfucker looks like Kiritsugi. <laughs> that kid looked like young Kiritsugi. This guy looks like a grown up one. <laughs> Same hairstyle, man. Near four table. What was 31st? Way jump, jumped ahead. Is it possible that, that she died? Shiki died there? And now they have to replace her with her. That might be the case. Or she might be injured. They need to replace her with her. Someone who can either see the future or six sense. Thoughts. <laughs> the boy loved. Loved and lost. What's she fucking banging on about? 
or she's in love with him. In love with the guy with the glasses. <laughs> Little girls, man. I have crushes like fucking too easy, man. Amy, that's you, fam. Anna, that's you. <laughs> she just met the guy. It's like, I have a crush on him. There we go. Her blushing is so much it comes out of her fucking cheeks. There we go. <laughs> now she has time to think. This was in the past. She saw her future. Ah. The killer. That's why they call her the killer. So. She saw that she killed someone. And now we're, I think. I guess she saw that she killed the. That guy was in a suit. So it wasn't the bomber man. Hold on. Was that him that she killed? When I tell you this, it was him. Oh, the suit. Fuck, she kills him. I wasn't entirely sure his face down in that. It was him that she would have killed. Shiki. Oh shit. That is weird. Like fucking... He saw something like that, and now he's just chilling. I'll leave you for an hour. Oh my god, impressionable young young girl, man. Story of my very first love. I had to say it, but I was in love, exactly. And a pleb. Admiration, exactly. Full of shame. Look at them over here. There are too many people over here in conversations, man. <laughs> Who the hell is this? I didn't realize this was going to be an all female anime. Who the hell is this? My new roommate? The fuck? She and I will be together for a year, no much longer. Oh, she sees. So this is one of her uh, year later fucking premonitions. My inseparable and best friend. That's the whole story. She already knows her summer, man. <laughs> I still see the future. Nothing's changed. It's been solved. Good, you just take a day at a time, man. He that's one thing she learned off him, man. Like fuck the future, man. Live live your life, man. Evaluate. She saw this. Not shut it. She probably foresaw that, oh, she'd be scared of the dog barking, but you know, fuck it, man. Live by that belief with a smile on my face. Oh, 
What's going on? What's going on? There he is, bomber man. Was that bomber man? Looked a little bit different. No, no, no. It's not bomber man. It is bomber man. <laughs> so, hold on. What happened then? There is I. Power the eyes got. So what happened? When he blew up those, when he was trying to blow up those cars, an explosion did happen. Oh, I okay. He's lost out. He's been humble in, a, in his own way by what Shiki was saying. Wow, he's a good self. A nice little place. He's got future blessing intro. 2010, August 2010. He's much older here. He looks much, much older. Too lively and bright. <laughs> That's some nice plants growing here, man. Look at that overhearing conversations. Ah, oh, she's reading. All right. What the hell is she reading? Her book. Mitsuru. What happened then? When he fucking blew up? Or tried to blow up? Didn't he get reprimanded or killed or... Bring you a job? Sama. What is going on? Oh, <laughs> who is this? Order. When we first met, where did you first meet? What happened to you, fam? <laughs> Who is this ten year old girl? Why is he fucking doped up with her? Gangster, fucking gun grave mode. Uh, Brandon Eat, that looks like, with shades on. Oh, the real gangster just stepped in. Uh, but how did she let him off that time? <clears throat> the vampire's tears. Does she have some sort of future site? Big boss is on the door. Detective agency. Huh? 
is there, Shiki. What is going on? Did she let him go? For what reason? She's pretending like she don't know him, but she knows him. Job you bring from the gang, yeah? She's recruited him, I guess, after fucking up his eye. That's all I can imagine. The recruitment fest. Ah, the fortune teller. Mother of Mifune. Why? Why take care of her? She's not done anything that they can prove. But Shiki doesn't trust her. The old back still alive, mother of me for that. Why is he alive? Like, why has he survived? Shiki used to kill everyone. girl though like why is she so special why is a little girl giving orders out <laughs> god damn man animes nowadays where little girls are running the fucking show man over adults Mana, mana. I like magic. What? <laughs> what is she holding in his hand? Like, what is so special about this bitch? That's a route that was taken by her. Um, her mom, I guess, before she. I don't know what relationship she has to this girl, though. But she hired him in the de detective capacity, this dude. And his ability to see the future would help her that. So he's really investigating this mother and me for it. Because they suspect that she's at the heart of. Anissa. Someone please explain what's going on, man. Because now I'm just switching off, man. But do they explain in other films? Because it's out of chronological order. Girls don't have to pay. Where's the fucking equality in that? Love fortune between me and my papa. Crossing ethical boundaries. What the fuck? Defeating my mother, taking back my papa. Are they trying to elude that he's the her dad? But he does. He doesn't seem to have known that. That Shiki had it. It seems to be implied that he's a dad when he tried to hold her arm and they're trying to say that there's some sort of like slightly excessive sort of relationship. He doesn't seem like he knows her that well, so he probably didn't raise her with a single kid. You can't see the future.
no anymore. Is that true? Past ten years. The times have passed you by. Or the times they are changing. Yeah, what's happened in the last 10 fucking years, fam? He had a daughter, as it seems. <laughs> What happened that night, man, in the in the garage, park sorry, parking lot, Mitsudo san Oh, you just like my papa. Whoa! So hold on, he shares qualities of a. I'm good at using people like you. You like my papa. Wow. <laughs> the boy wants new what what is going on? Where where are all these connections? Oh god, eight fucking movies to watch for me to get the full picture. What number these fucking animes play on you, man? God, eight movies I gotta sit through. It's one of those Bacano non-linear fucking things that they force you to keep watching so you understand it by the end. Before you were born. Has Mana been described her dad, but she's never met him? And this he is actually her dad. What's going on? Something I heard is bugging me. Yeah, if you can't see. For hope, to give people hope, I guess. To f Why indeed? Helping other people is give to give hope in it. Positiv positivity. A girl changed my life. No, I'm sure it was Shiki that changed his life. Yup, he destroyed that eye. That only had his eye on the future, man. A life full of failure. <laughs> Still. Who is this fucking girl, man? I love this lady. Loving anyone, everyone you meet. <laughs> Fully man as mother. So what's the deal? What's gonna go down? Should I? 
Rabbit. Good on you, but here we go. Fucking, we're gonna find out now what the fuck happened. Slave to that feature. There, it looks like it was. <laughs> he was killed. Okay. Not calling the blast. Okay, so he was a 14 year old boy. Okay, it was him. What happened to Shiki then? How did she survive? Oh, she disarmed. She's in a human. Not of this world anymore. What does that mean? Not of this world? Like she's in human or he saw her there? When she bought this girl. The gangster's daughter. Not of this world anymore. We clearly saw that this girl being bought to him by her. Shiki was the character design too similar. <clears throat> to Yogi Mana. My father thanks you for it. I get the gangster dad, yeah. What am I saying? She's a gangster's daughter. She can't be his. But she just, you're like my papa. And then she said that he had exactly the same qualities that her dad did. The gangster. What? Who is she? Why is she bossing man's around? Mitsuru-san. Had my mother to deal with. Start the last boss first. <laughs> well, all the women are fucking breaking necks and taking checks, man. It's not of this world anymore. So, hold on, sir. Ended ten years ago. He got given a chance though. They still haven't explained man, like what happened to Shiki, the one who fucking she got away but she said he's not of this world now. Clearly see the present in my left eye. Night ninety six, we're going back in time again. Trist. If I disappear, she can live happily. Of course it doesn't scare you, but like, what's the deal, man? I guess by 2010, oh, she's not of this world anymore. So by 2010, he's referring to the present, that she's not alive anymore. 
but she was then and she is now because this is what six years before what we just saw and she the do that little girl it seems to be the daughter of Hashiki and the glasses dude I'm assuming and the glasses dude is still alive but then they're referring to it like she's alive like what's going on anyway it's, it's a bit a bit obtuse man on purpose but it doesn't need to be I think that might be the subs I'm, I'm not entirely sure that's the thing give me my fortune there she is she's got a little dagger there terrible future that awaits me. It seems as though she didn't avoid the future. Or did she? I don't know, man. You're going to die. There we go. So she is dead. Thank fuck for that. Someone fucking clarified that. Because they're talking about her in 2010 like she's still fucking alive. I need to take Papa back from Mother, the, the little girl in the future. My future is pure shit. I guess that's why she gave her daughter to him, to put in his care or charge or something. Mitsura. But come on, please tell me there are not going to be eight movies of these fucking non-linear storytelling. It's pointless. Just fucking pointless. It basically says that the show's got no, nothing to say. It literally says that. It's got nothing to say, but they do it like that just to give it the hook or a fucking, you know, gimmick. Your dream will live on. Yeah, your door will live on is what it's trying to say. So what I want to know, now the big question is, how did she die? Hope we live a long life. She does. She's still alive six years from now. A weird sort of universe where a woman just sits there, like, forever. Then <laughs> fortunes. We were introduced to that character in the beginning and now she's disappeared for the second half. My dream will live on her. Your dream will live on is more like your legacy. Pretty sure that's through the door though. And because she seemed to have let that guy go, the bomber man, he's indebted to her in some form. The problem some animes do when they tell stories like this is they give people character designs that are too similar to others. I'm hoping this is the same woman that we saw hand over her daughter. I'm happy again. I rarely fall off. <laughs> Alright, people. Interesting, man. Nothing fucking special about that first film. It's just, I've seen fucking plenty of anime like this. Nothing stood out. Interesting. The Bomberman's interesting. The guy was given a sort of a new lease on life. Thanks to her. But then we were, there was that thread where she's going to kill her. She's going to kill um, the glasses dude. So without a left, unresolved. But I'm guessing there's eight films. And I guess explained. You know what this feels like? An anime they've taken and they've just mashed it together. Cut it into eight films. Mixed things around. Sh 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 shook it the thing. If that's the case. But I'm hoping, you know, really obtuse storytelling. 
out of order. But if it was planned this way, uh, fair enough, I have to get the whole picture through eight fucking movies. Hour and 28 and eight of these to get the full picture. I don't know if I can commit to this. Once every two months, maybe I'll react to this. I sort of picked up what happened in this. You know? There's still some things that just don't make sense. I'm pretty sure that that girl that's walking around with the bomber, man, 10 years on, is the daughter of her daughter, Shiki's daughter. And she's also the daughter of the guy with the glasses because they're a thing, apparently. But then they said in the beginning that you're in love with someone. Okay, okay, I, I get it. You kind of allude to the fact. And he said, you're like my dad. And dad has sort of like a future ability. So I guess maybe the little girl's just saying that the bomber man says, you're, you're the right, you're my papa and all that shit. All right. Not the best move, man. Someone could have recommended me something better than this, man. Come on. I just started with a Millennium Mattress, Perfect Blue, or Tokyo Godfather, man. But look, I did it. You know, if you guys can convince me that it's worth sticking with, like you did when Gintama started, and I was like, oh, man, this is not good by episode 9. Then I stuck with it, and it turned out to be really good. Not what I expected, man. This was described to me as something very deep. It was deep to an extent, but it was all right, man. It was all right, I guess. It doesn't. It doesn't. It, it doesn't make me want to watch the next movie. To be honest, if I'm going to be honest, it doesn't make me want to go watch the next movie. Unless it gets crazy, then please let me know, man. And please let me know if it's worth sticking with. Because this is an hour and twenty-five minutes I could have spent on reacting to another LOTGH or something. So I'm going to put this up though because I don't believe that only dick riding fucking uh, reactions should be put up. Like, I'll only put it up if I'm dick riding it and hyping it and being all animated on thing and getting the community hype and shit. You know. But I think the criticisms were fair, man. Fair criticisms. We didn't... There's no character I really give a shit about. I do like the bomber man, though. He seemed compelling. I like these kind of edgy sort of characters. Everyone else... Just all type of characters that we've seen, man. Nothing special about them. I think that stood out. But I like the concept. I like the concept of the concept they brought up about evaluation and predictive future, like predictive future telling, future seeing versus evaluative. Because it, it, you know, I think it depends on the character of the person as well, which dictates that how that works. Mirai Yuku. If there's no after credit scene, uh, these credits will be cut out. Animation was good, you know. You know what you all. I was under the impression that this would be a shorter first uh, thing. Someone told me it's 50 minutes. This was an hour and 28 minutes long. Kala no Kyokai Mirai Fukuin. Hallelujah. 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 <laughs> I just said it. Alright, there seems to be something after these credits. God damn, come on. UFO table. Kala no kyokai. But it didn't... Hour and 20 minutes, man. Fuck. If it was 50 minutes, I wouldn't mind rendering. This would take a bitch to render, man. There we go. That image looks nice here. Yeah. Why is she stalling? Like, just chilling. Okay, did she just look back at the screen and smile? Alright, alright. the hell did that add to? Get me hyped for the fucking next film at least. Alright people, thank you for watching man. I'd say I hope you enjoyed it, because for the most part you probably would have enjoyed that reaction, but it doesn't stand out to me man. Really, really there's nothing remarkable about that film absolutely nothing remarkable about that film it's just shot you know I guess 
you know, because it's a film OVA, it's, you know, it's got above average animation. I'm not particularly thrilled to continue watching it unless, of course, you can make the case that this does get better and better and things make more sense. I'm pretty sure this is the first film, man. Uh, but yeah, thank you for watching. Be sure to comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter for the latest live re reaction updates. Uh, those details in the description box below. Click the icon on the bottom right to subscribe, and thank you very much for watching.